to do with it. Yeah, sometimes you got to be lucky, but she's also a lot more than lucky. You know, she has some of the most difficult, in fact, the most difficult beamer. Tiny little gymnast from Iowa. She told us. After the first night, she actually loves being in that position, and so far, it's all going very right for her. It's not big, big, big skill right here. Back with a full. This first tumbling run is, is crazy. Tumbles. Tumb wow. Yeah, you really just shouldn't. Watch this right here. Back with a full. <laughs> but so far, personally, I have zero off. Maybe, maybe a little. And this will be her first big tumbling that takes the entire length of the beam. Oh. <laughs> you know, I haven't, I haven't, I have not seen her wobble on that, and that is so hard. It's not just the punch; they kind of jump softly. Bam. Right here. Bam! Away because if you ask somebody else to do that, even some of the best in the world, it would look nothing like that. What's so incredible is this skill right here. Full twist. Big moment right here, all the way across the beam. Perfect. Of course, one of her other risky skills coming up. Deduction. But a significant one for her. Got a skill coming up right here. Big time, three in a row. Watching the warm-up, she struggled quite a bit on her full twist, very uncharacteristic for her. Bang on. That she does not have bad nerves. <laughs> she says that she gets better in these situations. It always amazed leading up to the Beijing Olympics was her focus on this event. We used to just put our pens down. You know, just a couple moments ago, as she gets ready. This is a big tumbling pass right here. The most challenging. True tumbling has been very consistent here. But just a few moments ago, she watched her teammate, Gabrielle Douglas, who was having a much better night. Day two, just really. There were little checks here and there. Won the gold medal in 2008 on the 